lessons. After a few weeks, going down to see Mr. Hyde was a normal activity. I would spend my time with my father, Jekyll, during the day, and during the night, I would spend an hour or two with Father Hyde. One day, when I went downstairs to meet him, he was somewhat extra creepy. Now, Cecilia, I noticed that during a little accident, you used a little dividing, and they were sort of guns. Why? Because I have learned a little of how to fight, and I didn't carry, and I don't know how to use a gun or sword. Hmm. Well, maybe we could change that. Without warning, he tossed the sword over to me. And when I had it in my hooves, he pointed another sword at me. I looked up at him, and he was smiling. A mischievous smile. You ready? I smiled, lifted up my sword, and started to fight him. Mother came down once or twice to see if we were okay. She was scared the first time until I explained what we were doing while I was fighting. By the time we were done, I was smiling, and I seemed secretly impressed. I ran upstairs with the sword that he gave me, with the promise of doing it tomorrow. Hmm. Maybe you're not your Jekyll's daughter, after all, he said, looking after me. As the week progressed, I got better out of my sword fighting. The sort of activity we seemed to both enjoy. Eventually, I became maybe even close to his equal as we had all-out battles, which would end with your eye touching the handle of the knife on the shoulder. Mother was the only one besides me who knew of this activity. Dad never asked of it, so it was never discussed. It came in handy one time when I ran upon another gang, and I fought them. I warned them first, of course, but they left me no choice. I fought them until I was the only one left. I didn't particularly like the killing part, but it was something I had to do to protect myself. And I understood why I liked this. In the fighting bit, energy would flow through my body. This was quite adventurous. I suppose it was somewhat satisfactory. When the foe was down, I still didn't understand why he liked to kill them whether in the past or in the present, for sport and not for self-defense. I suppose that there are many things I won't understand about him, but I'll try my best to.